Hi, today I'll be showing you how to model and rig a tentacle in a few minutes. So, first we're going to create a circle of 32 vertices that we will then extrude and it is on this piece that all of the modeling will be done. Next, we are going to scale down the top of the mesh by a precise number that you need to remember for later. I chose 0.965. You can use a higher or lower number if you want your tentacle to be a different length. Now I'm going to add the suckers. In this part I add a mirror modifier, then I subdivide the mesh a bunch of times to get enough vertices, and after that I select a rectangle that I round out. And now I create the suckers. You can follow what I do here, but you don't have to if you have a different way of modeling these guys. So I'm gonna add an array modifier and set it up so that every iteration is on top of the previous one. Now I'm gonna use object offset and link it to an empty, which I will scale by 0.965, the exact same number as earlier, so that the top vertices connect to the bottom ones. Then I'm going to apply all modifiers, remove the doubles and close the top of the mesh. And finally I finish it by adding a subdivision modifier and using smooth shading. That's it for the modeling. Now for the rigging it's even easier. I simply add a bone at the bottom of the mesh, set it to front and then I extrude it by one along the z-axis a bunch of times. Then I extrude it more by 0.75 and the last few times by 0.5. The goal of the change of size is to allow the tentacle to move smoothly from top to bottom. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching.